Software X, so this goes into chapter 9 stuff with logarithms and bases and common bases, exponents, whatever. Now 25 and 125, um, we can find a common base for these in order to get rid of them completely, which would allow us just to solve for the exponents, all right? So for example, if I wanted to simplify 25, 25 is the same as 5 squared, and then this would be to the power of x minus 2, and this would equal um, 125 is the same as 5 cubed, so I got 5 cubed now to the power of x. Well, see how I have the common bases there? And it may help to see this in parentheses first. What this means is that I can get rid of the bases, or they kind of cancel out. It's the same base property for these exponents. So I really have 2 times x minus 2. And this would equal, this would be 3 times x right here. So 3x. And now I just need to solve for x. So distribute the 2. 2x minus 4 equals 3x. And now I'll subtract two x's from both sides. And I get x equals negative 4. Bam. Of course, you should check this, especially on a test. So 25 to the power of negative 6 should equal 125 to the power of negative 4.